Hey guys, how we doing? We got another edition of the rounds for you here. Unusually unseasonable day. Kind of led me to something a little higher octane. So we're going to swing out through Colorado and hit Breckenridge for probably what's been one of my favorite beers from them thus far. Uh, this is from their 471 series, which is normally their limited edition, something along the lines of a dang tank or uh, solitary confinement, any number of limited edition programs out there. Uh, this is their double IPA, 9.2% alcohol by volume, and uh, let's get right to it and see what we got. Let's see. Nice, thick, creamy head. Beautiful orange hue, similar to uh, some other double IPAs out there, like a Hop Wallop or a 2X from Southern Tier. Still a, still a touch of malt on the nose, which is kind of surprising. I mean, it's almost always just kind of a hop punch right to the nose, but this still's got a touch of that sweetness to it, and the hops just linger in a nice floral fashion. Good bit of citrus in there from the smell. The head seems to hold up pretty well. It tastes like they used whole leaf hops. It's got just a touch of that grassy character to it, but it almost seems as if it's come by it genuinely. Um, so a little bit of malt sweetness, uh, definitely a hop spike, uh, hop forward, hops on the front of the palate. Kind of decreases a little bit. There's maybe one more good hop spike at the second third of the flavor profile. Actually finishes really clean though. Leaves just kind of a citrusy rind flavor to it. Um, this is why it's one of my favorite from Breckenridge. Breckenridge is highly acclaimed for their vanilla porter. Uh, it's a staple in, in almost any craft beer place you go. Uh, but if you do see this, uh, this is the Small Batch 471 Double IPA. It's absolutely fantastic. It does not drink like 9.2% at all. In fact, it drinks more like 7.5, 8. So this is one that can easily sneak up on you. Till next time, guys. Here's uh, Glenn Gresham saying straight to the gills, people. We'll see you later on the rounds. Have a good one.